There's an amazing transformation taking place halfway to the Antarctic on Macquarie Island. A pest eradication program coordinated by Tasmanian Parks and Wildlife appears to be succeeding. Hills once devastated by a plague of 150,000 rabbits are recovering and more seabirds are nesting there. Fiona Breen went to the World Heritage listed island for this report. Across the island, there's strong evidence the $25 million eradication program is already successful. Hillsides once covered in eroding rabbit burrows are blooming. I've been coming to the island for many years and, and I saw the decline um, of, of the vegetation over a number of years as the rabbits were increasing. And it's really, it's really quite impressive to see just how much the vegetation's improved. The plants most obviously responding to the change conditions are the endemic Macquarie Island cabbage and the tall tussock grass. Leaves normally nibbled to their base are now in full bloom and seedlings litter the landscape. It's just vegetation growing everywhere. Um, even on the plateau where I haven't seen cabbage plants before, they're just you know, starting to shoot up now, so it's been a real surprise for me. For many of the regular expeditioners, it's an amazing change and a welcome sight. It's really exciting because my job hasn't been all doom and gloom like it has been in the past, so it's really satisfying and encouraging. With new growth comes new wildlife. More seabirds are nesting and successfully breeding. Biologists report seeing higher numbers of chicks in the past 12 months than they've seen in years. Fiona Breen, ABC News, Macquarie Island.